Lam Gyuli. Everybody, nice to meet you. And uh, my name is Lam Gyuli. And uh, today, this lecture is my uh, first lecture in English. My age is 60. <laughs> I wonder um, if I made a mistake to in speak English. Uh, please uh, understand me if I made a mistake in speaking English. Please. And uh, my major is archaeology, and, and partly I studied the uh, archaeometallurgical study. Do you know? Archaeometallurgical study fields. I, I developed the new field in Korea. Mm. First, mm. and I first I met. Professor Lee Jong Su, <coughs> 40 years before, uh, in that university at the <laughs> at the uh, Catholic Church, as a teacher of uh, weekend Bible school, and for two years we were uh, teachers of the church. <laughs> very, very, very uh, happy uh, age. That period is. Memorable and uh, in my life, and, and today is my today is my first lecture in English. So today is very uh, memorable day for me. <laughs> uh, let's begin my lecture. Well, today's title uh, is the traits of iron making technology in ancient Korea. This I make means the, uh, the formerly uh, Professor Lee introduced steel making. But uh, this iron making involved the iron making and the steel making together. And uh, today's table of contents is forward iron making culture in Proto Three Kingdom Age. And uh, do you know Proto Three Kingdom Age, for instance? Do you know? Don't know? And explain later. And uh, the third is the development of after 4th century BC. And uh, finally, uh, systematization of technology and the procedure. This is the main point of today's lecture. And uh, finally, closing remarks. I'm sorry. And early century and the important time making sites were increased in middle age area of Korean Peninsula. But nowadays, uh, the, we are in situation of the lack of research about the ancient iron making technology. And, uh, and Today's uh, lecture's purpose is understanding of the development of iron making culture from Proto Three Kingdom AG to the first stage of Pekche. Pekche uh, is the uh, one nation of the Three Kingdoms. And uh, today's uh, most important content is the epoch making development, that is, the uh, enlargement of iron making base and the introducing of patched steel technology. And uh, uh, in metallurgy, you know the this term, patched steel. Don't 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 use. Yes, uh, later I'll explain. <laughs> yes. Mm. What? I don't know. Yes, this is the more general uh, concept of uh, the uh, I'm making, and today is the this is the. Uh, Magnetite, hematite from uh, raw material. This is the uh, second uh, middle procedure of half deoxidation condition. Finally, we produce the uh, FEC. And this uh, principle is uh, used to the uh, before modern times I'm making. And uh, generally, and before modern time, uh, they produced the and the pig iron and the sponge iron in condition of a mixed condition. And uh, this raw material, they go to the next process, 
I'll explain later. And the, today's lecture's final goal <laughs> is to explain this uh, process of ion making, steel, ion and steel making in, in ancient Korea. And uh, this is the results of my study for 30 years. <laughs> yes, recent. Uh, I, uh, I prepared an article about uh, this uh, procedure. And today, I <laughs> introduced you <laughs> before <laughs> pressing. Yes. And uh, this, uh, generally, I, you, I think you know this procedure, but uh, I, I'd like to explain according to the ancient condition. And uh, from this procedure, and iron ore or iron sand is the most as a uh, the material and the second secondary uh, pretreatment and uh, cachination. Uh, cachination is done, and uh, in ancient time, and uh, after that, and the smith the smelt began smelt smelting. And at the time, they uh, used fuel, as a fuel, they used the charcoal. And, uh, and one more, one more po important point is that at that time, in ancient time, they used the slack former. We analyzed as a result, we find the, that very, very important factor. They, they used the limestone or and the bone. Understand? Yes. And that it, after smelting, they made the uh, uh, sponge iron and pig iron and mixed together. With it. And uh, there are two, mainly two directions there are. There were, and first three, they used first three pig, from pig iron and the melting, casting, and heat treat, treatment. Finally, they produced the white pig iron, gray pig iron, malleable pig iron in ancient times very, very an uh, important point. And from the <laughs> ancient point, they made these kinds of iron and steel. Iron, this is iron. And uh, mainly, and this technology is uh, developed in China. And, uh, and 100 years BC, and this technology came to Korean Peninsula uh, through the Lolan colony of the Han Dynasty. And uh, the second direction is the, from the sponge iron, they refined the material and the hammering, and finally they put the iron tools. And uh, this is generally uh, understand the factor, but uh, recently we verified the very, very important uh, information is the, uh, this direction. And, uh, and about Three century BC from, and that uh, in Baekje and Mahan, they used from the pig iron and the molten treatment and the molten melting treatment. After treatment, they uh, put into the uh, decarbonizing raw material. As and uh, they at that, that time they used the uh, uh, iron ore as a decarbonizing material, the iron particle. Yes. And that as, at, this, at the, this work, they finally produced the patched steel iron. The principle is the same as the modern times method. And, and if, from this raw material, they and the hammered the steel, and the, finally they made the iron tools, very, very, the skill is very um, sufficient at the time. And that mainly, you know, the, it, at this direction, they made the uh, big iron weapons, a sword or uh, the various, you know, various weapons. Excuse me. Sometimes I, when I speak English, mixed with Japanese. <laughs> I have studied in Japan for five years. Yes, uh, let's see the next scene. 
Yeah, this is the uh, process of I'm making and, uh, in ancient China. Is the, uh, this uh, the procedure is uh, the verified in 1974, uh, 40 years before in China. They uh, announced this uh, research results. And they, at the time, they uh, uh, explained the uh, charcoal plus oil. The this direction is the high temperature uh, course direction. This the peak iron, the uh, various peak iron they made in ancient times in China, and the five peak iron, great peak iron, uh, malleable peak iron, and this is developed in at this. Pig iron is developed in warring state in uh, China. Uh, um, about uh, four century BC. Yes. And uh, the and the, this point is the decarbonized the, and what. Uh, one more important still making is the, this line. And uh, this is the uh, some fat, uh, unique tec technique. Says the, uh, this is the decarbonized steel from pig iron in condition of solid, style, solid type. Yes. It's, don't use this time. Use, use nowadays? No, no. No, yes. And, uh, at the time, and the, uh, 100 years before, uh, one, one, 100 BC, in Han Dynasty, they uh, first reproduced parched steel from the uh, molten melt type and pig, pig iron. They, and uh, and uh, this is the uh, unique technology from uh, ancient China. Uh, Universally, the most <laughs> developed uh, technology. Uh, no technology in Europe. Yes. Yes. And uh, one more. Uh, in Europe, they uh, they used this directions technology from sponge iron and uh, uh, carbonizing, carbonized steel, and uh, this this types. Mainly in Europe, they use this type steel. Yes, this is the difference between Europe and China and Korea. The principles of our making process is the same between the ancient and nowadays. And uh, <laughs> this is uh, pure is somewhat different. And uh, uh, in ancient time, from ancient times, they uh, do a preliminary treatment. Nowadays. Uh, the same method and the the bonus height bonus type is the same and shaft type yes and uh, today's the, the height is about 100 meters yes in ancient times how much only two meters <laughs> this and uh, uh, one more time uh, one one uh, one, only one procedure they couldn't make the peak iron. Yes, do you understand? Yes, they they needed the uh, about one and two the procedure is needed. Yes, this is what explosion. I don't know. <laughs> ah. Formerly, I uh, talked uh, about the uh, uh, Proto Three Kingdom, and this is the, the division of archaeological time in ancient East Asia. The, is, this line is China, Japan, and uh, this is the uh, Paleolithic Age, Neolithic Age, Bronze Age, and uh, BC 300 years, uh, early Iron Age began, and uh, BC one century from one century proto three kingdom age began and uh, AD four century three kingdom age began. Yes, understand? 
Yes. And nowadays, uh, until now, and uh, I'm making sites, and the uh, south part of the Korean Peninsula, about uh, 200 iron making sites and from ancient time to the Chosen Dynasty, the 200 iron making sites were excavated. Yes. The founded and founded number is uh, much more. And uh, regrettably, the, those part is not unclear. Uh, next, let's see the iron making culture in Proto Three Kingdom period from BC 100 to AD 300. Yes. Early Iron Ages iron making sites are, are not found, and uh, the Three Kingdom Proto Three Kingdom period uh, iron making sites is the uh, hammering sites mainly, and uh, the in settlement they produce the at the base. Settlement and the next three they distribute to the neighbor settlement the raw material or ready made iron tools. And the, this make, uh, iron making sites were separated two kinds and the first three uh, refining sites and the hammering sites. And uh, sometimes uh, two kinds. The two kind technology is mixed sites are found. The Tonghe, Songjongdong sites, or Kapyong, Majangi site, Taesongni site, Hanam Misari site, but this is a mistake. Yeoju, Yeonyangni site, Hwasong, Giani site. Uh, after uh, I explained the uh, Taesongni site, Yeonyangni site and the Hwasong Giani site, I'll explain. And uh, uh, formally, I explained this procedure and the smelting and the distributed to big sites uh, and the raw material and the refined hammering is the one direction, and the one more one direction is the uh, casting iron uh, produced at the this. Uh, the to produce uh, casting iron sites are uh, at the um, um, much more big settlement or central place or in castle. And uh, after casting, they distributed the casting iron tools to the wide area. And uh, this is the Distribution chart of iron making site in Proto Three Kingdom period uh, centralized the in, in, in center of the Korean Peninsula and uh, uh, southeast part of the Shilla, uh, Proto Silla area. And this Chungcheongdo, Solado, Solado uh, is uh, very, very bare. Yes. And this is the one sample. Uh, the Yeoju Yeonyangni size. This is the pit house, and uh, this is horse, and one more horse is the furnace. That uh, surround that near the furnace, we found the waste as a, a scale granular slag, and it, at this settlement site, we couldn't find find the smelting site. Yes, one more sample is the Kapyong uh, Taesongni. Have you gone to Taesongni? Do you know? <laughs> very, very uh, good view, the landscape, yes. Uh, very good date course <laughs> for youngers, yes. And uh, this is the uh, North Han River, and uh, this is uh, the railroad from Seoul to Chuncheon. And now, and in this, on this uh, more, this uh, sites were excavated uh, uh, when the Gyeongchun uh, railroad uh, this station is 
uh, deep built it. Uh, this is Gapyeong Daesongni size. And this is the uh, pit house. This uh, type is very unique. And the house type is Pentagon style. And this is village. And, the, and from the first tree, this place is excavated. And the next tree, this place is uh, excavated. And the, uh, the excavator found uh, many potteries and uh, on tools. This is pierce, piercing tool and the plow. And the, uh, knife. This is at, at excavated art defects. And the many various iron artifacts were excavated, the knife, arrow heads, and uh, uh, pasted the X and uh, fish hook and pierce, piercing tool and plow and the same types and iron net bags. And this, uh, these uh, artifacts were made uh, various kinds of both iron and the steels. Yes. One I uh, casted uh, X is the analyzed this part and uh, very important thing is uh, that this metallurgical structure is uh, the cast from cast pig iron and uh, after through the heat treatment the Pig iron structure changed this structure. Yes. Uh, formally, I explained explain the uh, decarbonized decarbonized the steel yes, in solid situation condition. Is this this types X is the that. Uh, made by that technology. And uh, very, very not uh, economical method. And needed much <laughs> fuels. And the uh, result of EDS analysis is this three uh, this inclusions and the switch this type. Yes. Uh, and the uh, sickle, uh, lobic types, uh, this iron particle is the uh, raw material to make the uh, iron tool. Uh, and this is the raw material to produce, uh, to make uh, iron uh, tools. Yes. And, and uh, at this then uh, sites the they used a uh, uh, pig iron, uh, not many. They mainly uh, the main raw material is the uh, sponge iron, yes. And uh, this iron tool is analyzed. That uh, this is the uh, made of the sponge iron. We, we verified. One more sample is the Tonghe Songjeondong uh, sites. And this furnace is uh, entirely destroyed, but uh, uh, from the surroundings, we found the, uh, the many uh, waste, and we, uh, we came to know this site, this furnace is uh, the Defining and the hammering furnace. Yes, both function. Uh, this uh, furnace have a both function. We think, and uh, from that furnace, uh, surrounding from surroundings, with uh, uh, the excavator uh, found the scale, drop to granule material, and uh, uh, blast pipe. And this is the Songhe Dongjongdo sites uh, artifacts excavated. Uh, Next, next, next uh, site is the uh, Kiani site. And uh, uh, these sites uh, have a very, very important meaning. Yeah. The, this Kiani site in Gyeonggi-do, uh, Hwasong, uh, uh, this Kiani site uh, at this place, uh, the Smith the group uh, the from Lorang uh, group 
to, uh, made of uh, iron and steel, and uh, especially the, this uh, site's main um, characteristic is uh, uh, they made the, the patched steel. And uh, uh, not only patched steel, but also smelting and steel making. And uh, beside the furnace, the excavator uh, found the kiln of charcoal. And, and uh, this uh, Kiani site have uh, many uh, political and uh, meanings. Uh, the first read, and uh, we must think about the relationship between the Pekje and the Rolang. And, uh, uh, the, from this site, we must think about the uh, inflow of patched steel technology from Lorang, uh, uh, from Han Dynasty and uh, through Lorang to Pekje. And uh, uh, together, uh, we must think about the relationship between Mahan and Lorang. And very, very uh, complicated problem. And uh, it not only technological problem, but also have uh, uh, very uh, important political problem. And next, I'd like to explain about uh, at the time situation. AD 3rd century, this place is the Pekje, the, before the Three Kingdoms Pekje. Yes, this is the Pugna Odon Castle. And uh, uh, this is Seoul, and uh, this is the uh, East, uh, West Sea. And the uh, Kiani site is here. And uh, this area is the Mahan area. And the uh, uh, Kiani sites located between two political powers. A very, very imp imp interesting situation. Kiani sites uh, map. And uh, this is the uh, excavated area. And the surroundings, every hill <laughs> is uh, archaeological important site. Uh, this is uh, at this site, uh, totally a uh, six point were excavated, and this is very important uh, place. And my university, Hansi University, is here. <laughs> the, my so uh, near the near the my university, there are many many uh, archaeological important sites. I'm very happy. <laughs> and this is the result of the. Uh, Drawings and this is this furnace. Furnace. Uh, this furnace is not uh, uh, the uh, not the smelting furnace. Many refining or uh, hammering uh, furnace. And uh, uh, smelting furnace is located another place. Yes. And the smelting furnace is mainly uh, placed at this area. And this area mainly. And furnace of uh, refining and uh, hammering. And this is the kiln of charcoal. Yeah. Beside, they produce the charcoal and uh, distribute the uh, fuel. Mm. Yes. This is, this pottery is the Lorang pottery, not Pekje pottery, not Mahan pottery. Yes. From the group who came to this place from. Low down. This is the blast pipe. The diameter is about 15 centimeters or 20 centimeters. Very, very big. Yeah. As a result, we don't know how they blow the blowing. I, we don't know the, the techniques. This is the ore, excavated ore, and the slag. Uh, from now, let's see the 45, 30, 30, 40, sorry, yes. Difficult? Not difficult? Contents is, yes. <laughs> uh, I think this, this level of information is uh, common sense for you, yes? Not? <laughs> yes. Let's see the 
development of after four century. This is very important. Uh, from explanation, ex explaining uh, the, the, is the uh, three ancient nations times. Yeah. From now, I'll explain the situation of the Three Kingdom period. From now, our history began ancient society. Yes, the different level, different kinds of iron culture they create. Yes. Let's see the uh, situation. Oh, yes, I'm sorry. First three, situation of Miho Ribo. <laughs> Miho Ribo, do you know? Yeah. King Ribo, Kumgang. Yes, everybody knows Kumgang. The branch is the Kumgang, branch is the Miho, uh, Miho Ribo. Yes. Yeah. The King Ribo's upper branch, his name is Miho Ribo, and uh, at that Upper area, uh, very, very uh, important iron making sites were excavated from uh, 20 years before. Yes. Yes. The name is the Sokjangni and the Busanni sites. Yes. Uh, these two sites were located at the lower hill. And uh, uh, the uh, furnace types is smelting furnace and the steel making furnace, casting, uh, not Funds were not found, only uh, related materials only. Yes, the hammering yes, funds were excavated. The, this is the iron making size uh, three kingdom era, uh, from three kingdom era to United Silla. Uh, and that. Uh, the same um, situation is the, the this place. There are many, many uh, iron making sites, and the, the this uh, Shilla and Kaya uh, area. Uh, there are many uh, iron making sites, and <laughs> this Chungcheongdo and uh, Cholado. Uh, there are uh, very, very rare, and uh, because of the. Uh, in lack of uh, iron ore, I think. I think. Uh, let's see the first three meaning of the Sokjani sites. Uh, these sites uh, have a very, very uh, important meaning. Uh, first, uh, the main concept is the uh, this iron making sites is the constant total iron making place in ancient times. Yes. <coughs> Seven iron making place of, uh, on the low hills and uh, about the uh, area of uh, one, uh, 1400 to 700 area. The, the process is smelting and the steel making, hammering, and the casting. Mm. Uh, uh, the process is found. And the important concept is the large scale and the constant process and the concentration of distribution. Specialization of technology, increase of productivity. Yes, this is this iron making sites have uh, important meaning, you know, and concept. Uh, this is very important iron making site in ancient worldwide. Yes, and uh, uh, this is the uh, somewhat different uh, meaning that uh, the, this. It, these consistent, they made uh, a very big system to produce iron and steel making process, and they, the, uh, as a result of uh, efficient control of production and the distribution, I think. That, and the technologically, the epoch making development they made. Then the, uh, at the time, the, uh, the capital is at the Seoul was in Seoul, and uh, this is the country place. The, and the, the Smiths produced at the place uh, iron and uh, uh, distributed the uh, iron to the capital city. That's what the system of tributary payment system to central place, the capital city. 
uh, pulling up. Later, I explain the important uh, packages, uh, capital city. Uh, this is the place of the Sokjani sites. Yes, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven places were discovered, but only one place uh, was excavated. Yes, from now, uh, let's see the, uh, the place. The separated A zone and B zone. And uh, uh, this is the uh, round shape of, shape is the uh, furnace. Yeah, furnace. And the smelting furnace, mainly. Yes. This place is the main smelting furnace. And this place is uh, refining and uh, hammering furnace, the main. Yes. This is the arrangement of all this. Yes. This and the uh, Sokchani sites uh, that. Choose to change. <laughs> like, I entered the picture display. <laughs> I, I can't understand what that problem occurred. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, <laughs> Soka. Ah, Soka. Korean in Japanese. I'm sorry. <laughs> this hub, uh, this at uh, at uh, in. Fourth century, they uh, used uh, this type's uh, furnace, yeah. but upper part of the furnace were, were totally destroyed, not remained. Yes, we, we couldn't find find the upper part of the uh, furnace everywhere. <laughs> uh, only remained on the ground part. Yes, yes. The, uh, the, they made a. Uh, uh, a special uh, uh, layer to protect the moisture. Yes. Mm. Well, mainly, they they the, the cover yes. sometimes. Yes. Mm. And uh, one problem is that this twenty types is box type, long box types. But uh, we can understand what, what kind of work they do at this place. Maybe I think it's possible at this place they do a work of uh, cash nation. Yeah. Uh, at this site, the very Blessed pipe. Yeah. Diameter is 15 or 20 meters. Centimeters, yes. And this is the inner mold of a hole, yes. Our cultural tool, hole. The outer mold was, they excavated, uh, couldn't find. Why <laughs> only <laughs> there are, there are uh, only in the world? I don't, I can't understand. Ah. Uh, after excavation and Chongju National Museum uh, do experiment, uh, to, to use the model of the Chokjangli sites, they do work uh, for two days, but not successful. <laughs> Why? They, they, there are many problems to do uh, experimental archaeology. They, and, uh, uh, first three, they uh, have a, they the, to produce the, uh, this furnace that not sufficiently dried. <laughs> foolish, foolish experiment, very, very. You can see the moisture of the, uh, go up. <laughs> yes. Very, very, uh, uh, the temperature is not go, go up. Yes. Can't go up. Yes. And the one more important problem is the, this blowing. 
technology. Yes. This is very difficult to solve now. Yes. Uh, one more site. Let's see the uh, aspect of middle range of killings. This is Yonjeri site. Uh, this site, from this site, we could find the ore. Uh, this site, is the, they, at this place, they do the work from big iron to patch the steel, I think. But this just opinions were separated. Some researcher uh, say that from at this place, they produced uh, pig iron or sponge iron, but I don't think so. And the uh, charcoal kiln was found near the furnace. And uh, this, uh, from this site, important meaning is the this site is the working site of the second process. And at this site, we can understand the producing and the distributing system of our making. Let's see the detailed contents. Yes. You know the, this, this label, the, the KTX line, yeah. this here is the Osong station. Yeah. I will pass the station to the soul. Yeah. And uh, when the Osong science complex were uh, built, uh, constructed at this price, Yonjeri sites were excavated, and this is a lake. Yes, you see it. And this is the furnace, uh, smallly remain only beneath the furnace. And this is the big pit house, and then semi charcoal kill. Yes, this is the. Uh, uh, Chosen Dynasty's pit hole. Yes, this is a lake. Uh, pit house. Who lived here? The worker lived here. <laughs> yes, this uh, charcoal killer. And uh, only this the underground part is remained. And the uh, slacks and uh, this lake. And from this situation, we analyze the this size and uh, explain the character of this voice. Very, very difficult problem. Yes. Let's see one more. Uh, Chungju, do you know Chungju? And uh, uh, middle range of the south. Very, very important in the in Korean Peninsula. Uh, from ancient time until uh, Chosen Dynasty, uh, most important part of uh, I making place is the Chungju. Yes, let's see the let's see the that place. Uh, which more important is site is Chilgum Dong site location near the Han Ripple. and. At this size, near the plate, this size, uh, about 70 iron making sites were discovered. Yes. yes. But only one furnace excavated as an uh, ancient furnace. And, and this furnace is very big, mm. diameter, 1.8 meter diameter. Very big furnace as an uh, ancient furnace. Yeah. The most, most big, yeah. biggest, the biggest size. Yes. yes. Happily, we can understand the underground structure. Yeah. And uh, uh, many. I am making sites and furnaces is destroyed tot totally. Yes, yeah. the underground until underground part. Why? The worker 
destroyed himself to protect uh, secret, his secret, very, very import, information to protect, yes. Yeah. In ancient, from ancient Korea, and the same in Japan, yes. As a result, we are very, very <laughs> unhappy. <laughs> it's d difficult to, to uh, we, we, uh, it's very difficult to understand the uh, underground structure. Yes. Uh, and uh, uh, surrounding these many most legs and uh, this uh, uh, near the this size, important other castles were located. And, and uh, uh, Chungju, from Chungju side, we can also understand the relationships between center and the periphery in Baekje, yes. This is the, uh, politically, uh, we can understand the ruling system of the uh, distributory payment. Do you know distributed payment? Very uh, difficult uh, term, yes. Uh, in ancient times, and uh, periphery put the uh, the uh, leader and the relationship, the central place and the periphery, they uh, related with the, some far, very, uh, many kinds of uh, many kinds of relationships. And uh, one one method is, and in periphery they produced uh, iron or copper or various uh, uh, peripheral important uh, products. They distribute to the central place. And as that uh, method, the center and the peripheral relations, be, they make it more, much more strong. Yes. Understand? Yes. This distributory payment, we, uh, in history, we, we say this uh, method, they maintain the ancient nation. Yes. The, at the distributory, at distributory system, the most important item is iron, yes, understand? Mainly, the Chungju area is the most important place in ancient times, medieval times, and the uh, Chosen Dynasty. Yeah. Nowadays, <laughs> we forget <laughs> almost that uh, very, very important uh, knowledge, yes. The Chungju city and the Chilgumdo size and this uh, and uh, the surroundings uh, the ka uh, kumga myon the ka gum myon the uh, kum kum yes king I don't know the gold eh? gold not gold this kum kim do you know kim kim do you know Let's learn <laughs> Chinese letter and, and yeah, <laughs> this means the gold, not gold. This middle the mean the uh, iron. Yes. This place, king, kum, God, I'm sorry, <laughs> uh, gold, not gold, uh, iron, 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 iron. Maybe iron. iron uh, Produce sites were located in this area. Right? About 70 sites were discovered. Yeah. This, uh, the, uh, many iron making sites and uh, charcoal kilns. Charcoal, much more charcoal kilns. Yes. But uh, nation's government uh, of uh, cultural heritage. Absolutely, <laughs> not have interest in this site. <laughs> Very beautiful scene. This is the uh, the uh, <laughs> south uh, south uh, Hangang as Han River, and uh, this is the Taichan, the, uh, the branch of the Han River. Yes, this is Tangum there. So this. this this place, the, the Chilgumdo site, site, yes. Here is the excavated area and the, the Tangum de, the, 
Do you know? Tangumde? Do you know? Do you know? Uruk? Gaya, from Gaya, the uh, musician. Uruk uh, played the uh, traditional uh, uh, music to the, at this place in Tangumde. And uh, uh, one more historical uh, extent is the Shilok, during Imjinoran. He defeated at this place. And this is the Tangumde castle. And at this castle, one more important uh, artifacts were excavated at this place. Uh, Chilgumdong site's furnace. Is, it, this underground structure is uh, remained happily. Yes. The, and this is the furnace and the slack, with, to, uh, uh, slack pit. And uh, this place is the pre treating place, cash nation place, I think. Yes. And this, <laughs> only this. But uh, the diamond, uh, 1.8 diamond to s size. And this underground size. And the uh, or powder of ore and the slag and the pottery and the ore breaking place, this place. Yes. Near Chigudom site, and, uh, uh, in the castle, and this iron ingots were excavated. This is blood, blessed pipe, stone grinder, and the iron ingot. Forty iron ingots were excavated. This 40 iron ingot that's, that is recorded in the historical records of the Japan. Yeah, this is the ingot. Yes. I'd like to analyze this ingot. It's not, but it's impossible. Yeah. <laughs> Unhappy, uh, unhappy, and uh, uh, to know the uh, that there is technology, we must analyze these artifacts. But our government didn't understand. Can't. <laughs> this is, this ingot means that the nowadays press. Procedures the same method and the made by the same method, I think. From that ingot, the, the, those ingots in uh, pictured people, Walker and Smith, and made the very many kinds of iron, iron tools, weapons, and agricultural tools, and uh, uh, the kind, uh, very, very various. And iron tools. One more uh, site is the uh, Tapioni, and this is the uh, same, the South Hannibal. And uh, uh, last year, at this place, the boat, uh, international boat race opened, you know, at this place. At the time, they destroyed this important site <laughs> to cons <laughs> To build the uh, building. Yeah. At the place, the blessed pipe, large blessed pipe, were excavated and uh, from uh, hexagon type, hexagon type, uh, and at uh, three ki proto three kingdom time uh, era, they usually used the pit of uh, pentagon type, and uh, from. Uh, Fourth century BC, Baekje people lived in this type and uh, hexagon type bit house. And uh, at in the in, near the, the pit house, these you know, I'm making tools were excavated. Chosen Dynasty Smith and Tejangkati, Kim Hongdo and uh, Kim Dukshin. 
Yeah. Who's paint is much more dynamic? The, how do you think? Much more dynamic painting is left, right? Why? <laughs> ah, tired. <laughs> I think this is much more energetic. And, <laughs> and I think the, 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 in ancient times, the, the, the smithing is the the method of smithing is different from chosen dynasting. Yes, but how they do make a furnace and uh, uh, how they work, I, I, uh, not known. But is many many and uh, uh, part is unknown and uh, mainly and for and four century BC from four century BC they. Uh, use the uh, hammering tools uh, as an iron tool, but Proto Three Kingdom period, absolutely not. We, we couldn't find the tools to uh, when they uh, the hammering hammering tools. We couldn't find at the time. What do they use? Yes, tool. tool. What kind of tools they used at the Proto Three Kingdom period before uh, three century AD? We couldn't find find <laughs> hammering tools. That's a problem. I think at the time they used the uh, stone tools. Mm. Uh, sometimes we find the uh, uh, marks of the hammering yeah, at, at end and part of. It. And from fourth century, but fourth century they used the iron tools to hammering. Let's see the uh, one more place, uh, Rohan River, uh, uh, around the Seoul area. It's Pungnap Capital Castle. Let's see. There is no smelting site. There are only smithing and the casting. And uh, in the Pungnap Castle, there are in manual industry in capital. Castle, I think, and the Guanyong Sugo. This is the uh, this is the centralization of iron making by na national control. That from a fourth century BC, uh, the iron making was controlled by the, the nation and the central place's power. That's a very, very um, big difference. And the uh, manual industry of royal place. And uh, from the base, the nation enlarged the finance and the national prosperity. Yes. Yes. Uh, but uh, finally, I'll explain the eye making and the distribution system of. Uh, Spiller label, the Pericoris character. Yes. Let's see the uh, Pungnap Castle. I excavated this site 1997 and 1999 and uh, 2000. At this place, center of the Pungnap Castle. Do you know Pungnap Castle? Do you know? Pungnap Castle? Don't know? Oh. 
from now have an interest <laughs> about <laughs> very, very important <laughs> castle of Baekje. Yes. And uh, I'm very happy to excavate the central part of this castle. Yes, at this castle, the Han River, and uh, this bridge is Olympic Bridge. And uh, uh, regrettably, this castle is destroyed by the construction of the apartment and the main houses. Uh, I, I, I excavated the, this artifact. This is the mold of the casting. Yes, to produce the agricultural tool, agricultural tool, hole, small hole, yes, mm. or pick. In a out part and in a part, yes. Only that, <laughs> only those, and because I have to excavate all, a small part of. Only that I couldn't find the furnace. I think there are a uh, central place of the iron making place to produce uh, many kinds of uh, iron tools at, in the castle. Why? At the time, nation controlled wholly, nation and government controlled the iron making system. Nationwide, way. Yes. that's the difference from before times situation. Yes. And one important part is the nationwide control, not only nationwide control, but also peripheral small civilian. I'm making production domain. This is the. One sample of the civilian, not controlled by the nation's iron practice. And uh, I have this excavated this uh, artifacts, Hwasong, beside my university. <laughs> and uh, this uh, iron, this, this iron is from iron sand, not mined ore. And uh, outside of uh, the nationwide, nationwide control, they produced freely produced the iron and distribute and use make and use the iron. Yes. yes. And uh, how do we distinguish the? Iron sand from iron ore. How we can distinguish? Let's see the, this EDS result. What element means the iron sand? Do you know? This titanium. Titanium is involved in iron sand. Not in the iron ore. Yes. Many titanium proteins is found. Yes. Very interesting. Mm. Yes. Ah. Formally, I explained this systematization of technology and procedure. This I explained uh, almost detailed technology already. Yes. Short, short, yeah. More, uh, all slag, low material, half oxide, oxide the material is uh, analyzed and mainly by me. Yes. More, so, and uh, this is the metastructure of uh, pre-treated uh, ore. And uh, uh, we distinguish the uh, uh, products. Uh, this is the deoxidized metastructure and the half deoxidized metastructure. This, uh, the, uh, in ancient times, first three made when they smelt, they produced the, these two metastructures mixed, were made. From that raw material, they 
have next procedure. And more. And this is very important. Uh, this is patched steel that involved inclusion, almost really. very fine steel yes, at the time. This is the great pig iron hole, just iron, already made. Uh, several times the uh, uh, experiment of smelting were done, but every experiment failed. Why? They didn't know the metallurgical knowledge and the theory and the principle. Yeah. The, the, firstly, we must think about uh, um, metal engineering and uh, metal uh, logical uh, theory, knowledge, and the process, and we must study and uh, compare. Next time, we must compare the archaeological data and combine the two fields of knowledge. We must, we can succeed, I think. Now I'm uh, I studying uh, to combine two fields, but very <laughs> difficult. <laughs> yes. uh, but formally, uh, explain this contents. Yes, well, and uh, totally, this contents means that. The in ancient times, Koreans ancient iron making technology was most developed level was in the world. Yes, don't forget this important things. Let's study together from now. Very. Very important, but not interesting. <laughs> That's the problem. And uh, uh, thank you very much to hear my poor lecture. Thank you. <laughs>